Matter is a useful concept to chemists because chemicals, in the broadest sense, are matter. We use the term property to describe chemicals. You could think of a property as an adjective for chemicals. What sort of properties do you think are useful for describing chemicals? Stop the video for a few seconds to see what you can come up with. You may have come up with some other examples, but what first came to my mind are color, the state at room temperature, which we signify as RT, luster, which means shininess, which can be useful for solid chemicals, melting point, or MP, is useful for solids, and boiling point, or BP, is useful for liquids. The ability of a chemical to conduct electricity is also an important property. Scientists are constantly classifying, so we have some sort of structure for our knowledge. Accordingly, properties are classified as either chemical property or a physical property. A chemical property describes composition, reactivity, or lack of reactivity. For example, the fact that copper does not react with hydrochloric acid is a chemical property. Any type of reactivity, including lack of reactivity, is a chemical property. On the other hand, a physical property is any type of description that does not have to do with reactivity. In our everyday life, we typically use physical properties to describe chemicals. For example, all the properties we listed earlier, such as color, luster, and electrical conductivity, are all physical properties since they are not related to a chemical reaction. Here's a list of properties. I'd like you to pause the video and determine whether these are chemical or physical properties. This is something you will need to be able to do for your homework and this is a concept that you are likely to be quizzed on. Start the video once you have your answers. If you said that a colorless liquid at room temperature is a physical property, you are correct. Neither the state at room temperature nor the color of a chemical have to do with reactivity. If you said oxidizes in air was a chemical property, you are correct, since oxidation is a chemical reaction. If you said that explosive is a chemical property, you are correct, since explosions are chemical reactions. If you said that does not react with acid is a chemical property, you are correct. Lack of reactivity is a chemical property. 